Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Mrs. P. Tarleton. If you're new here, welcome. Please consider subscribing so you will be notified each week when I upload new videos teaching teachers how to use technology. Today I wanted to show you how to add freehand drawings to your Google Slides. So let's head on over to Google Slides. So here I am in Google Slide. If you go to insert, go to line and then scribble, you can draw or write whatever you'd like. It does take some practice. You can also change the color. You highlight it, you can change how thick it is. You can even make it dotted or dashed lines. We have dashes and dots. The only drawback that I find with this is that every time you stop, it has to be a continuous motion. So if you were doing cursive, it would be perfect. So what I suggest using this for is something really basic, very simple. Like if you had a Venn diagram, you're gonna have students write numbers down pretty easy, basic. Multiples of three, we have multiples of five. So insert my scribble, and then we can write our numbers in here. So it is a little time consuming, but it's definitely possible. So this is one way, or if you don't like this option, another option would be to use Jamboard. I'll go ahead and link that up in the cards above. And if you created your slides in Jamboard and it's free, then you won't have to have the start and stop, start and stop. So it might be a little bit easier. These graphic organizers here that I've created, but there's a much easier way. I'll go ahead and link that up in the cards as well. And in the description, I'll show you where you can find a bunch of graphic organizers to help you in your classroom. Remember, step out and be uniquely wonderful you. Have a great day.